Hello everyone, this is size 12 long shank hook and the thread is block. I'm just gonna start below the eye, take away the extra piece and I'm going to add some wire just to give a slight weight. I normally use this pattern for still water so you know Just catch this wire and then wrap it around as much as you want. That should be okay. You can add more weight if you're fishing in the river. So once you've done that, secure it properly and then go towards the bend okay for the tail I'm going to be using it's a pheasant tail and just catch take some fibers few strand so just alter the length you want make sure they're sitting on top Okay, and uh, for the ribs, I'm using this is a gold rib, so if you can catch them body length and use your cover all this. It's a bit larger nymph so we need a little bit body should be a little bit larger. Right. Uh, for the body I'm gonna be using dyed olive hazier. So this is my hazier dubbing. I'm just gonna apply that gently. as scruffy as possible. I mean if you want a scruffy one then you can just put soft dubbing or spiky dubbing. We just do kind of one Let's work with the body actually. Just some more. And try to bring the ribs just about three turn and secure this right um, for the thorax and head I'm using seam it's a pheasant tail so I took a quite a bit you know just to give a nice head so if you level the tips and just catch them on the top gently. Just couple of turn and pull them back. Now here, all you have to do is just set them up nicely on top. Make sure you take your time and see if they are sitting okay. Uh, 
Right, that's fine. Okay, now I'm going to use the same olive dubbing, the body I use for, but I'm going to add some black hairs here. This is dyed kind of yellow, but the, as you can see, the tip of the ears has got black here, so I'm going to mix that with this dubbing, olive one. I need a darker head, so all I have to do is just add some wax on your thread, and all I did is mix all this dubbing. So get a little bit darker color. Just rotate my vise and just apply that gently. Take your time. Need a nice head, you know, so we have need to put some more dubbing onto the head. see this one first and then if I need some more or some more so just go very close just keep coming down using touch in turn I'm gonna add some more actually so Box your thread. Just, you know, natural dubbing is a little bit tricky to use, so just have some patience and take your time. Okay. Just spin your thread when you put dubbing on, it just helps, you know. Okay, lift them up and then what we have to do is spread them equally on either side. Once you've done that, just kind of lock them and pull them downward. And then gently bring your Thorax cover. Take your time again. I'm going to make sure it's sitting okay. No. Like I said, just take your time and then when you're happy, you know. That should be okay. You'd have to have a hundred percent fly to catch fish, but Okay, now just add some wax on the thread so we can lock this properly. And we finish. You can leave as scruffy and some varnish on the head. Just try your brush properly when you put varnish on. Just try to avoid the material so you don't get onto the material. Even though it don't make any difference, you know, when it's underwater, it's all wet. So, so there you have an olive gold rib. Here's your nymph. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.